Greetings everyone, I am Chris, I am Austin, I'm Jason, and we are the Trias Gamers, and today we are going to bring you No More Heroes for the Nintendo Wii. Yay! And of course we're doing this on the Wii U because Austin's uh, Wii currently doesn't work at the moment. Wii U is a damn good purchase though. Damn right. So anyways, uh, let's get started with World Heavyweight Title Belt on the this, on this screen there. Nice. Now I had some uh, fun memories of uh, of uh, playing this game. Uh, I first heard about it by uh, the Autark. Yeah, I heard about it from. Uh, I believe you told me about it as well. Yeah. And I started watching a uh, let's play of it by a guy named uh, Turner Four Five Nine Zero. Me too. Uh, Jason, where have you heard of this game before? I've heard of it because my friend Kyle wanted the character from this game, Travis Touchdown, in Smash Four. Which probably might not happen. Yeah. That, that Although I would really like to see that happen. Could happen, but you got to realize how mature he is, and that would take a but but little censoring just to make him kid child appropriate. <laughs> and snakes knives aren't. Hey, you know. Anyway, this was this game's made by Grasshopper Entertainment and Ubisoft. It was published by Ubisoft. Ooh, published. But uh, this game made by a guy named Suda Fifty One. Yeah, he makes some good games, although I have yet to play Lollipop Chainsaw slash Killer is Dead. I've seen Ubisoft publish a lot of games. Press A. Yeah. Now we're going to do this on mild mode. The reason why is that sweet difficulty... Let me just... I'm not going to spoil the final boss, but let me put it in terms of this. For the final boss on sweet difficulty, it's 100 hits to kill him. On mild difficulty, it's 250. But on... um. The hardest one, which I think is uh, Sour, it's 1,150. Damn. Yeah. So we're going to do That's a real big gap between those. Oh, you do not want to get me started on that. All right, here so we go. So anyways, uh, we're playing as this guy. We'll find out everything. Oh. Hmm, whistling. So he has a motorbike. That's a, that's something we're straight out of Star Wars. Badass. Zaka TV. I know a lot of games out there don't have much patience. At least that's what Bishop, the dude at the video store, said. So I'm at the register, and I realize I got no money. I was seriously broke. Why? Because I met this smoky hot chick last night at the death match bar. Man, she smelled good. So being the gentleman I am, I bought her a drink. Anywho, I decided to get a job. The game assassinate the director. So I went where I was supposed to. I'm waiting for the guy to show up. And there he was. This cat, well-dressed, cool, couldn't tell if he was the shit or just plain all shit. Yeah, so he's got fast, aggressive, and packing heat. Bada bing. Or at least it was supposed to be. Until she showed up. Her name? Sylvia Crystal, an agent with this Watch McCall Association. Congratulations. You are certified as the 11th best hitman. How about getting me just the 10 killers above you and aim for the top? I want to be number one. How's that? Sure it's simple enough for you? It's gonna be a long, hard road. But who knows? Could kick ass. Could be dangerous. Could play with suck. What do you say, bro? Join me. Let's see how far we can take this. And for you that only the Wii remote right now, just press the other button. And let the blood check begin. So. Yeah, that was, um, that was actually a pretty cool intro. What that you considered breaking the fourth wall? A little bit, yeah. That's actually a pretty creative way of doing it. Hmm. Or interesting, no less. Fuckhead! Yo, help me out here. Where's this death metal dude? Bad answer. It's game time. 
So, we start out by decapitating two guys and um, killing another. Good way to start a game. Yeah, yeah, play, play yeah let's do the tutorial just to show it off. <laughs> Beam Katana. That's the name of our weapon. It's totally not a lifesaver. Press A to hit someone with it. Pretty straightforward. Once, once its life runs out, you can do a death blow. When trainers do that, you just swing the Wiimote in a direction. It tells you to. Like this. That's always fun. Mm -hmm. So it's not completely motion controlled. By the way, uh, on the uh, loading screen, you can actually spam the B button to make the star rise. Gauge on the right side of the screen is the beam katana's power battery power. Each attack made with a beam katana will drain some of its battery. Unless it's the final uh, beam katana's uh, full upgrade. Oh, who gives a fuck right now? You will not be able to use the beam katana once the batteries run out. But you can kick people in the face. Who gives a damn? Now, recharge your beam katana. Okay, fine. Press the one button to go into charge mode. And here's the part of the running joke about here's the running joke about it about such thing. Swing the remote from left to right as fast as you can to recharge the beam katana. Swing the remote and totally char charge the beam katana. Here's the joke, everyone. Oh, 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 oh. That was so success. I successfully continue. Yes. That was just wrong. I successfully masturbated. Locking on and blocking. That was so inappropriate. Mm -hmm. That was kind of the point. That was just wrong. Mm -hmm. Hold, hold the Z button to lock on to someone. And on sweet difficulty, you'll auto block when standing still, uh, but of course we're not doing that because we're not total pussies. Hey man, careful with that. We're playing an M rated game. Do you think anybody really cares if I curse? Yeah, it will. Surprise. What the hell, man? Success! <laughs> oh, that was really tough. Although, um. Enter, emergency of aid. Hold, this, hold down, hold the Z button, and press the, and press the controls. Press the D-pad. Control that. Oh, fuck. Nah, fuck it. Press the... Basically, what he's saying is, hold the Z-button to target and then press uh, left or right on the D-pad to, to dodge roll. To perform an emergency unit aid. Yeah. I need to work on myself. Any attacks cannot hit you during an emergency unit aid. Use the control pad to perform an emergency unit aid. I need to work on my narrating skills. This probably is LP will help me do that. Come on. Well, he didn't even swing at me. <laughs> This whole part's gonna be a tutorial phase, I swear to god. Eh, maybe not. Weapon clash. It travels the sword attack. Oh. Basically basically if you hit two weapons against each other, you'll perform a weapon clash. And if you win, you get to do a killing blow. Sounds pretty awesome. I wanted to do the narrating. Ow. Fuck up. Now it's time for the fun part. Swing the move on that button. It says to go in a circle, but really you could you could just swing it left and right. What what? Fun. And boom goes the diamond. We got Shaka. That sensor bar is odd. Wait, nothing? Oh, there we go. Are we done now? Damn it. Down attack. A button will appear when close to the down enemy. Press the A button to perform a down attack. Perform a down attack on an enemy. Sleeping on the job, eh? In the nuts. Ooh, that's not nice. This is me though, but uh, there's too much blood pressure in all these enemies. <laughs> I know, right? They're they, bleeding more than Mortal Kombat characters. They gotta stop. They gotta stop eating so much burgers and fries, man. All right, so here's where the really the motion gimmick comes in. Besides from besides from the weapon, besides from the finishing moves. Yeah. So basically, these are the high and low attacks. The high attacks are made when you tilt the Wii mode up, and the low attacks are when you tilt the Wiimote uh, down. Um, the low attack is basically the stronger but slower version. The high attack is the faster, yet admittedly, um, uh, let's just say weaker version. Strange. Use the high attacks uh, to hit enemies guarding low, and and yeah, basically just um, yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, let's see. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Success already. By the way, you can kill multiple enemies with just one slash. With one finishing blow, I mean. Hold on, let me change the settings real quick. Ringy, side jobs, config. config. 
Yeah, sure. Turn the dog on, please. Thank you. There we go. And speaker off. Yeah, you'll see. Because we won't be able to hear Sylvia Crystal. Uh, yeah, yeah, I suppose. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you'll find out anyway. Yeah. Part one of our very first Let's Play on this channel is going to be on now. Tell the Wiimote forward and Travis will adopt a low stance slashing stance. Then swing the beam katana to perform a low slash. Soon, enemy, some enemies will guard Travis's beam katana attacks. Use low attacks to hit enemies guarding high. Attack by using low slashes. Success! These bald guys are about to kill. Ooh! Bye! I need, to re- I need to reposition that center block. Ooh. By the way, if you know there's a slot machine, uh, we'll get to that later. Oh, yeah. Wow, well, uh, this part is going to be a tutorial. <laughs> beat attacking. Press the B button to perform a beat attack. Beat attacks will break an enemy's guard. Okay. Beat attacks also have high and low versions. Yay. A high beat attack will be performed from a high stance. And of course, a low beat attack will be performed from a low stance. No shit. Alright. Hit an enemy guarding high with a high beat attack to stun them. In the same way, hit an enemy guarding low to hit them with a low attack. Hitting a gu- hit a guarding enemy with a beat attack to stun them. I think you already just said that like three times. There you go. Where did you hit him? He's in the face. It's kind of a melee. Right in the this face. This enemy's now stunned. It's sort of a... Stun. Oh, here we go. A stunned enemy is totally defenseless. You can then follow up with a beam katana attack. Wipe out enemies. Ah. Oh, I have to finish him off. I can't do... Rack with attack. I thought it was going to show Ooh, up. Ooh, right in half. Nice. Are we done? With- if you think that's impressive, you should see some of the bosses. Yeah, we'll get to that. Throws. Now we get to the part that I like. Stun an enemy. Simple enough. Come on! It's funny. Once an enemy is stunned, press the B button again to grab him. Grab him! When you sex- successfully. Sex- successfully? <laughs> Two arrows will be displayed at the top of the screen like this. The right arrow is in the, is the direction you must move, move the Wiimote in. And the left arrow is the direction you must move the nunchuck in. Move both simultaneously in the display directions. Now we're getting the nunchuck into this. Now we're fancy. Bro, enemy. Evo! Suplex! Success. Yay. Wow. <laughs> More <laughs> tutorials. I forget this. These tutorials are freaking long. Charge beat attack. Hold down the B button to charge your tech. When you turn, sure, Jack, the max you will unleash a charge beat attack. If a charge beat attack hits an enemy, it will automatically be stunned. Attack an enemy with a charge attack. Ow! Oh, you punk! There you go. Now let's suplex him. Oh, you forgot. Here we go! Suplex! Boom! Hey, don't hit me! Makes sense for a guy who just watched his best friend die. Brain Buster, actually. Brutally. Oh, fun time. Got me. Royal Pain. How dare you hit me? Has the tutorial done one? Please say, ah. ah. For the love of God. I speak of the devil. Charge Slash. Yeah, this is kind of cool, at least. Hold the A button and you will tr- build up power in your Beam Katana. Release the A button at the right time to perform a Charge Slash, and there's a high and low version. The upper, the high version is strong, but you can't move. The low version is weak on, depending on the Beam Katana, but you can move. You can also hit multiple enemies with some of these. Yeah, we don't need this. Yeah, we don't need to tell you more. Do it. You guys should do a Charge check. See, like that. I just killed a bunch of enemies, even though I didn't kill the enemy I was targeting. Sweet. Oh, you got charged up. You got charged up. Goodbye. You got charged up your beam down. Did you get oh. charged? I kept telling you to charge your beam down. I need to masturbate. Nobody leaves. Nobody listens to me anymore. Another brain buster. 
Ooh. Can't be targeting an enemy to kill them like that. Off with your head. What? Are we the Red Queen now? Who's the Red Queen? Don't you remember from Alice in Wonderland? Oh, Finally, yeah. Bren, we're done with the tutorial. Alright, yay. Now the gameplay. Time to get DDT! Serious. Really? Another DDT! You watch wrestling too much. Hey, I love wrestling. I don't blame you. So, looks like we get. Oh, <laughs> cutscene. Probably has to go here. <laughs> I think we should end the part right here, or do you want to. Eh, I can just split it up. But first, let's go here. What's in here? No. Oh, uh, yeah, I remember now. Sweet treasure chest. Money! Money! Cool! Thing you need in all video games. Money. Money. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna collect as much as we can. Yeah, it's like real life. Can't live off anything without money. It's what makes the world go round, my friend. I swear. Brain Buster. Was it just me or did that part look like something you'd see on an iTunes card? Except for it's more no. violent. Oh, I almost got triple bells. Ooh, this guy's trying to beast on you. Aw, oh, more... I prefer to go high attack, usually. Triple seven, really? Already? I'll have it stored for later. Mm -hmm. Because I know there's a part where, where you can use the triple seven effectively. Oh, great. What? Was that okay? Yeah. Oh, come on, look at that, right? By the way, you eat pizza to gain health. Good to know. Hmm. Why does it do that, bro? Why? Oh, you mean that staticky thing on the capture card? Yeah, yeah it just happens. Yeah. Don't worry, it doesn't actually affect the actual image. That's weird. My capture card's weird like that. You're welcome. Thank you. He's the one who got me that, by the way. 30 bucks. You're welcome. By the way, those blue chests are uh, batteries. You don't need them. For now. Mm, is that money? So basically, no, it's treat. best to save them for later. Well, not really. Just give him the chance. Yeah. Now watch this minus button. I get to use my seven. All right, that was epic. Yay! Saves time. Congratulations. Good and I got another trading card. Oh, what the hell? This was the. This is the dark slide. Basically, you get if you uh, time a dodge just correctly. Oh, three bells. Hold on. Is that your three bells attack? Yeah, I get to shoot projectiles. That's amazing. Kind of damage it off though. It just takes forever to turn. That's why. It's still up there. Plus, you're invincible during this state. Explain the dark slide again. Already did though. Oh, this guy's freaking out. He ain't playing around. Another three bells? Jeez, oh, I'm lucky geez. in this playthrough. This guy's luck has run out for him. Hurry for this playthrough. Aww. Well, I'm glad we're moving on. And now it's time to eat some pizza. Pizza, pizza. Ooh, pizza. You like to do that, don't you? Mm -hmm. nice. You press the C oh. button to uh, make the camera face uh, face where you're looking at. Yeah, it's good to know, I guess. It's almost like Zelda, except not really. But um, yeah. So a dark slide is when you um when you uh, move the control stick at the right time during an attack, like an enemy's attack. You can actually just slide uh, next to them, and you can um. Basically, you can um, uh, slide next to them, and you you basically rush them. Two for one, and I get Super Dude, Saiyan. That... I'm Super Saiyan. Yeah, he's Super Saiyan. Basically, you can swing any way you want. Yeah. That's don't me. Plus, I'm invincible, just like a real Super Saiyan. 
Wait, I know where I went down this way. You're getting confused. Oh, his hair is yellow and everything. Yeah, yeah. that's why I said Super Saiyan. Alright, uh, now we gotta backtrack. Yay! At least we're moving on. Hey, it's kinda nice that the game tells you where to go. Instead of leaving you in the dark. I'm on. Eh. It all depends how well the game does not mind me. It doesn't bug me too much. Yeah, it also depends on level, level design. More pizza? No, he doesn't need it. Don't need it, but that's, that'll always help. Just in case. Ooh. He was just three days away from retirement, too. I'm pretty sure that's everyone in this you're killing right now. I wonder how their families are reacting. Why do they stop? They're seeking. Oh, come on, I had to get it at this point. Maybe there's an enemy you forgot to get. What does this ability do? Turn. Wait, where is he? I want to kill him. Probably behind you. Turn, Turn around. He only walks forward. Oh, damn, he's running. Hurry, back. hurry, hurry! I'm about to run out! Damn it! Oh, yeah, I forgot. Charge attacks. You can't break him out of it. Really? Maybe you should stop using just high attack. This is a relatively creative HP bar. I like it. It's all right. Speaking of which, backtracking. Eh, it's not too bad. Go ahead and backtrack to a safe point in Metro. Oh, don't even get me started. We did need that to. pizza. What? I didn't even say no more heroes too. I said Metro. I know, I know but what was that game of horse backtracking? It has some instances of backtracking, if I remember right. Yeah, I think I do. I don't remember either. Boy. What a pain! See ya. By the way, I don't know if you know this or not, but this guy got his uh, beam katana off of eBay. Oh, <laughs> no. Three cherries! I'm super saiyan again. No, no, wait, yeah. it's just going. It's just super speed. It's a flash. Uh, that works. Yeah, the flash is awesome. He's in the new Super Mario. Can't wait for that. Oh, that movie's gonna suck. By the way, some like the Beam Katanas you can get. Some of them have a uh, different uh, like uh, uh, super slashes. Do these guys have katanas. Yeah. They're at a real disadvantage. Metal can't stand it too. Now I can show this off. Yay. Here we go. If I can... Basically, it's like brutal insta-kills. So I just gotta walk to them. No, wait. You forgot to hit the wrong button. I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> you're, discovering, you're discovering new things. Ooh, this is some Star Wars stuff. I'm Darth Travis. Goodbye. Now, now all I need to do is breathe like you have asthma. And then and have a giant no suit. There you go. Really? <laughs> Jesus you Christ, are on my a roll luck. today. Yeah, you're on roll, man. Too bad I didn't mean anything. <laughs> Although I do think you get points for uh Who plays for points anymore? I know, right? Hold on, box. Hit, <laughs> missed. That's quite a bit of money right there. And trading cards, because, you know, it's fun collecting cards. You gotta catch them all. I'm pretty sure we're we'll messing with you. This guy's putting up a fight. Not anymore. Goodbye. Yeah. What a joke. What a digital dummy. Yay. I guess. More training cards. Ooh, got great, now we got now I got people with guns. But now you're pulling a Yoda deflecting those bullets. Guns are people with guns, they're the worst part. Yeah, they're they're easily the worst enemies in this game. Especially the submachine gun ones. Which we'll get you later. In about like boss fight six, I believe. No spoilers. This area reminds me. 
This area reminds me of something. I'm, uh, I can't. I don't know what it's about. Oh yeah, that one scene in Sonic 06 yeah, where Amy that, gets, uh, where Amy saves uh, Elise. Why don't we never bring that up again? Kind of reminds me of Scott Pilgrim in a way. Um, I can kind of see it. Except for you're not going against seven people, and they're not the scrolls' exes either. But something I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure you should ask. Whenever one of you guys goes on a date with some chick that you never met, ask her if she has seven evil exes, just to see her reaction. Hold on, I got Master Brief first. There you go. That's just wrong, man. Man, this is a long hallway. Whoa, what the hell? My phone is ringing. So yeah, that was Sylvia Crystal. When well, yeah. I'm expecting to see a save point. Yeah, it's right there. Oh, you're gonna love the save points in this game. I think we're gonna end it at the save point in a while. Oh, hold on. Trading card. Yeah. First. Oh, what's this? A wrestling mask. Oh, we're used. Nice. Yep. With a letter in it. Yay. Travis. Do you remember those solemn days in Calgary? That's Canada. The path of pro wrestling you have long forgotten. Even if, if even a fragment of the spirit of a wrestler remains in your blood, remember the first suplex that your master taught you. Yes, that's right. The darkness piercing front neck chancery drop. MS. What does MS stand for? Oh. Now, now I have another um, suplex to add. Yay! That's gonna be fun. Battery. By the way, I get a battery even though I don't need it. It's there for because of, health. up next to the boss. But first, save. Hold on, we gotta show them how they how we save. <laughs> <laughs> now that's awesome. All right. <laughs> that's how that's how I'd save the game. All right. Well. I think this is a good stop, par, stopping point for now, guys. So, in all right, this has been a uh, Try Ace Gaming. I'm Chris. I'm Austin, and I'm Jason. We'll see you all in part two. Dumps.